Hey guys, what's good? Rising Phoenix One. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you're at. This video is presented by the EA Creator Network and a really big shout out to the EA Community Manager, Nick, because he's the one who got us these cards so we can show them to you and maybe help you with the choices you're going to make in the last two days of the April Fool's Show promo. So we're playing with all the 96s, Westbrook, Magic, Elgin Baylor, KG, and Joel Embiid. We're gonna take a very quick look at the stats. Obviously, Westbrook is fast. His dribbling is very good at 97. Good rebounding, good inside offensive game. His outside shooting, you know, it's pretty good actually. 87 is not low for Brody. I mean, they call him West Brick for a reason, right? Oh gosh, did I say that out loud? His defense is pretty good with an 88 on ball and an 86 steal. His box out is good and he has a couple good playmaking stats and that's it for Brody. Next up is Magic out of position at shooting guard. And like Brody, he has the post defense boost, which is boosting the three attributes in the bottom left-hand corner, plus block. Magic's athletic stats actually are quite good. Rebounding is low. Inside offensive game is kind of hit and miss, but you know, it's decent. His perimeter shooting, you know, is pretty low. He does have that 95 touch and 98 off dribble. 91 on ball defense is very good. And then he's got 93s at steal, hands on perimeter interception, and 90 drawing offensive foul. And he has some good playmaking stats, and that's pretty much it for Magic. But he's got some really good looking defense. All right, moving on to one of my two favorite 96s in this promo, Elgin Baylor. He has a playmaking boost. His athleticism stats are all right. Um, I mean, a 93 speed, 89 agility looks very good. His rebounding looks good for a 96 small forward. His inside offensive game looks terrific. His outside shooting is phenomenal. On ball defense at 87 is all right. And the rest of his defensive stats, except for his interception, you know, just really aren't there. And yeah, that's pretty much it. And then we have the other card that I believe is one of the top two. This is KG Kevin Garnett, and he has that athleticism boost, which is very nice. His athleticism stats are good, 92 and 91. Speed and agility boosted to 94 and 93. He's got a 99 boosted vertical, that's a big deal. 92 and 93 rebounding, looks pretty good coupled with a 90 and 96 box out. Inside offensive game is good. His outside shooting for a power forward is very good. And his defense is not good and his block is horrible. And then he also has both an offensive and defensive post presence. And then moving on to the card, I would rank as number three, Joel Embiid. Not necessarily because of the stats, but because of the way he performs and he has a playmaking boost as well. Speed and agility are good for a center. 95 strength, 92 vert, 95 tip in, all very good. Rebounding at 90 and 89 doesn't look that great, coupled with a 90 and 93 box out, but my experience has been he gets boards. His inside offensive game is terrific. His outside shooting, especially for a center, is great. 91 on ball defense is very good. 97 block is very good. The rest of his defensive stats aren't there. And he has, you know, an offensive and defensive post presence. Nothing spectacular, but not bad for a 96 overall. All right, so these are the guys we, we're gonna play with. I can tell you that I've been grinding this event no money spent. I got Elgin Baylor Sunday night, and I will have Joel Embiid tomorrow on the last day of the promo. Maybe today, um, but probably tomorrow. I'll need both days. And those token trade sets, that's what's gonna get me there. Plus the coin pack and the free pack for the Joker wildcard tokens. All right, so we're gonna jump into Showdown. 
We're gonna play two, see how these guys can do. So let's quit messing around. Let's get to the gameplay. Oh brother, yeah, this isn't the lineup we were looking for. Um, okay, we're starting with the ball and that's about it. So we'll see how we can do though. Let's see how these guys can do. Never say never, right? Never say never. There's our guy Elgin Baylor. And that's why I love him, right? That's why I love him. All right. So, oh, nuts, that's in. Siakam left, well, he's contested. I don't know who contested that. Brody to the corner, high risk, and he misses it. Yeah, that was a really bad choice, really bad choice. Oh, man, he gets the baseline. He got picked up by Embiid, though. Good D by Embiid. Back to our guy, Baylor, and he buries it. All right, six to two, but we're coming up on a minute into the game, so come on. Oh, nuts. Yeah, all right, six to four. We're gonna go with Brody at the top of the key. Boom, nice job, nice job. But um, yeah, come on, let's play some defense here. Oh my, that was way too easy for Lillard. He's overpowering Westbrook. Magic, catch and shoot in the corner for three. All right, 12 to six. Could we hold these guys? <laughs> Could we hold them for a possession here? Nice, nice swipe by Westbrook. Wow, Embiid picks up the loose ball and takes it all the way for the slam. 14 to six. That's good D, oh, that was great D by Magic. Oh my, 14 to eight. That's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to take him in for a slam or a layup, but he took the shot. Shoot, oh my. All right, we, we have to make a charge. If we're gonna do it, we got 50 seconds to do it. Come on, Joel, hit it. All right, all right, let's go. Good, good, that's off book, that's off book. We knocked it off book, that's our ball. We need to go to Elgin Baylor, we'll bring him back behind Brody and Oh, he missed it. Give it to him again. Give it to him again. He's going to make it. Boom. All right. 20 to 10. That's still not good enough. Come on. Let's go. We've got 20, 20 something seconds. Oh, nice block by Garnett. Come on, Elgin. Come on. Bury it. We need it. There you go. All right. We need to hold him and get it back. We need to hold them and get it back. Oh, nuts. Oh, nuts. Good thing he was on the line. All right. We got time. Let's go to catch and shoot. It's magic in the corner. Boom. Hey. So we finished off, uh, what, 12 to 2 in the last 50 seconds. I'll take that. This may or may not have been autoplay. I don't know. I don't care, we got the W. Another 97, he's got Lillard. Um, gosh, his bigs, his bigs look good. But um, yeah, we got, a, we got a fair chance to get a decent result with these guys. Baylor hesitates, takes it over to the wing. But, Moving it around kind of fast out there. Oh gosh, he's got PG-13. And there's Lillard with the midi. Three to two. Gonna go with Embiid. Bad release, bad shot by me. I mean, that shoulda, coulda gone in. So a uh, rather inglorious start for this second game play. <laughs> Come on, let's do something. Block it. Now get it. Shoot, shoot.
shoot. Oh, wow. That was a monster block. I mean, it's still there, ball. Um, yeah, the shot clock has expired, so they just have to inbound for the whistle to blow, right? All right. My goodness, we're a minute in and we've scored three points. We're a minute in and we've scored three points. Come on, West Brick, hit it. Oh, he misses it, but there's Embiid with the board. He gets it back out to our guy, Elgin Baylor, and he buries it. He's on the line for a two. My goodness, this is a low scoring game. <laughs> come on, come on, let's get a good second half. Let's go, oh shoot. Pistol, oh no, I'm sorry, that's not Pete, that's Havlicek. Little easy layup, he switches to the inside hand, his left hand. Nice job for Brody, <laughs> it's only seven to two. Uh, this could be an all-time low here, boy. All right, they miss. KG being very active, going after the board. Let's give him the shot. Boom. 10 to 2. We need to get some more points, don't you think? Because sooner or later, these guys are going to score. Nice. An offensive foul. They had two guys there setting the screen. I mean, come on, there had to be a foul. All right, there's our guy. Boom. Mr. Reliable, Mr. Reliable, Elgin Baylor. That's his new name. Come on, get us, jeez. I've had better luck than this getting steals with with Westbrook. Catch and shoot, Baylor hits it. All right, all right. We need to get the ball back, do something here. Let's hold him and get it back, come on. There, nice tip by KG. Goes right to the guy we want to have the ball for the buzzer beater, Elgin Baylor. Go in, yes, all right. All right, that was a much better second half than the first half, right? I mean, we were halfway through and we had three points. We had three points. All right, will it hold up? Let's see. Ooh, just barely, but we got the W, I'll take it. All right, well these guys did all right, and these are 96s and they all have boosts. Um, if I can grind without much luck at all, if I can grind and get two masters, no money spent, which is exactly what I've been doing, then I don't know why anyone else can't get that. You know, it's all about the tokens. And so I think I drew only one player card. Let me say it again, one player card. And that was for the Embiid set, not the Baylor set. So this is doable. Uh, it's an easy grind, you play the events, you're smart with your tokens, and you know there's no reason why you shouldn't be able to get two of these 96s if you get super lucky. A third one, it looks to me like the math that the team calculated when they made the recent changes to this promo format is spot on. All right, guys, so you know, good luck with the promo. Good luck with your choices. Hopefully this may have been somewhat helpful for you. And with that, it's over, it's done, we're out of here, there's no more. And remember, peace out.